In this video, we show you how we use the lactate test to measure the progress of an athlete from one point in their season to another point. The lactate test indicates the amount of lactic acid in the body. This is a fairly simple way to measure what's going on inside the body while you're running. If lactate numbers improve from one test to the next, then theoretically, so should your times in races. So we're doing a lactate test on Sarah Massey. We did one, I think it was in February, and uh, the conclusion was that she needed to work on her power, her um, ability to run fast when there's a high amount of lactic acid in her system. We're going to repeat exactly the same pace, exactly the same test, and hopefully her lactate numbers will have dropped and hopefully she'll be able to produce power um, at the end of the workout uh, more so than at the beginning of the season. Uh, we worked on that power production through uh, fundamental hill circuits, through uh, hill sprints, through hammers, through racing, 800, 1500s. Um, so we've done a, a lot of stuff and we're hoping uh, to see some results. But what I'm doing right here I've got a lactate testing monitor here, um, strips, so after each rep I'll prick her finger, um, put a strip in there, take the blood measurement, 5 times 1200 and then uh, an 800 as fast as she can go after. Let's go, Sarah. Let's go, Sarah. You can do it. Still right on. Get one more to go. <laughs> Alright, last rep. Last rep. Just stay on pace. Alright, Sarah. Let's go, Sarah. Woo woo! All right, there you go, there you go. All the way through, all the way, all the way, all the way. I just wanted you all to be quiet. <laughs> Specifically here, we're looking at Sarah's ability to kick at the end of a race. During her first test in March, she was able to run 5x1200 at 1745 k pace, but at the end of the test she could not run much faster than that pace for her 800 meter fast. What this means is that in March she could run 1740 pace for one half of a 5k race, but as soon as the race got harder she had to slow down and ended up running 1817. In the last two months we've worked on her ability to run 1745 k pace for extended periods and produce power during the middle and the end of workouts. As a result, she's been able to run 1743 for 5K. For the complete test results, see the PDF to the right. 